Hello, guys. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, Hello teacher. Good to see you. Good to see you, guys. How was your weekend? ¿Qué tal el fin de semana? ¿Cómo estuvo? How was your weekend? Good. Hi. Okay, was it hot? Very hot? Very hot. Very hot. Very hot. It was very hot. <laughs> okay, well, it's good to see you one more week. In, in this week, we are going to have our last classes. Um, and, but we finish next Monday. Okay, we finish next Monday. But excellent, congratulations. You have survived. <laughs> you are about to finish your first model, the first course of uh, basic English. Well, guys, let's see what is the topic of today's class. The topic is what time is it? What time is it? So we are going to practice giving or saying the time. Okay, and it's the class 12 today is, what day is today? Monday. Monday, May 8th, hey. 2023. Monday, May 8th, 2023, okay? So we have two lesson objectives. The first is by the end of this class, you will be able to talk about different cities and international time zones. Additionally, you will practice the conversation between two people in different time zones. By the end of this class, you will be able to ask and answer questions using time expressions and practice giving the time. So what time is it right now, guys? What time is it? Um, it's it is a o three. Yes, yes, that's correct, Marilyn. It's eight o three. Yes. Can you imagine three minutes passed very fast? Okay. Here we have a conversation. The conversation is: What time is it there? Two people in different places in different time zones. Okay, Debbie and John. I'm gonna read first the conversation. Later, I will need two volunteers to read the conversation. The conversation says, hello. Hi, Debbie, this is John. I'm calling from Australia. Australia? I'm on a conference in Sydney, remember? All right, what time is it there? It's 10 p.m. and it's four o'clock there in Los Angeles, right? Yes, four o'clock in the morning. 4 a.m. Oh, I'm really sorry. That's okay. I'm awake now. <laughs> okay, so when we are in different countries, when people are in different countries, there is a difference. In time, for example, right now in El Salvador, it's 8 p.m. But what about in Spain or in Italy? Do you know what time is it in Spain or Italy? Do you have any idea? I think it's 4 a.m. It's 4 in the morning. <laughs> okay. Um, well, I need two volunteers to read the conversation. Edith? Edith. It's going to be Debbie and we need John. Any other volunteer? Or victim. Uh, Marilyn, 
thank you. Ok. Solo una pregunta uh -huh. nada más. Yes. ¿Cómo se dice PM o AM? PM. AM. Gracias. AM. Ok. Let's go. Light, camera, action. Hello. Hi, David is John. Is calling from Australia. Australia. I am conference in China, remember? All right. What time is there? It's 10 p.m. and it's for a club. There is a Los Angeles ride. Yes, four o'clock in the morning. Four oh oh and on on I'm running sorry. Thanks, okay. I'm what now. Thank you so much. Please and applause for them. <laughs> thank you, Lee. Thank you, Marilyn. Yeah, so in this conversation, we have they are saying or they are telling the time. Well, you can see, you can see, guys. Uh, for example, it says the question: What time is it there? What time is it there? ¿Qué hora es allí? What time is it there? And we use the verb to be tell the time, it's 10 p.m., it's four o'clock, okay, in the morning. We have another expression, I'm awake, I'm awake, estoy despierta, o estoy despierto, I'm awake. Mm -hmm. And when we make a telephone conversation, we, we say hi, hello, and to say our name, we can say, this is Rocio, this is Marilyn, this is Edith, para decir, habla Rocio, this is Rocio, o eh, habla Maria, this is Maria, okay? So those are useful expressions. Very good, guys. Uh, if you are taking notes in this moment, I'm gonna take the attendance because I didn't do it before. So help me say in present or here. Adriana Noemi Quintanilla. Present. Thank you, Adriana. Viseida Yarisa. I'm here, teacher. Good. David Moises Ventura. Present. Thank you, David. Dolores Elizabeth Lopez. Elizabeth Lopez. Lopez Mejia. Okay, she's not present. Edith Carolina Rivera de Segundo. I'm here, teacher. Very nice, Edith. Edwin René Solís. Edwin René. Elisa María García. Present. Thank you, Elisa. Erika Elizabeth Carranza Ramos. Present, teacher. Thank you, Erika. Stephanie Carolina Ferrer. Present. Good. Fátima Santana Ponce. Present. Jonathan Vicente Escobar. Thank you. Present teacher. Thank you, Jonathan. Jose Alfredo Cruz. Present teacher. Thank you, Jose. Karen Tatiana Hernández. Present teacher. Okay. Catherine Vanessa Blanco Umaña. Present. Linda Hazel Fernán Díaz. Yes. Linda. Lizal Marisol López. Okay, absent. Marilyn Yesenia Ortiz. Present, teacher. Thank you, Marilyn. María Vilma Cortés Rivas. Present, teacher. Thank you, Marlon Adonai Moral. Present, teacher. Thank you, Marlon. Eh, Melanie Fabiola. Melanie Fabiola Cuella Rodríguez. Absent. Michelle Abigail Nieto González. Present teacher. 
teacher. Miriam Darlene Escobar. Present teacher. Thank you, Miriam. Rosibel Esmeralda Laín. Present teacher. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Good. Okay. Oops, sorry. Okay. So we have different clocks here. These are called co clocks. Estos son clocks. They are clocks. Okay? Clocks. But if I have here in my in my hand, what is this? Is this a clock or a watch? A watch. A watch. A watch. A watch. Exactly. Like we can it can be a smart watch, right? <laughs> Yes, it's a watch. But if you have a, a clock in your house, that's not a watch. It's a clock, right? And if you notice in this um in these pictures, you can see different time. It's one o'clock. Para decir en punto, decimos o'clock. O'clock. Then <clears throat> every number. Uh, means five minutes, right? Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55. And then we complete the 60 minutes, which makes one hour. In this case, it's one, it's one oh five. 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 Or uh, this is the easiest way. Es la forma fácil. The easiest way. It's one of five. But we can also say it's five after one. It's five after one. Okay. After quiere decir. También podemos decir past. No so, también es otra expresión que se puede usar. It's five past one. Ok, son cinco después de la una, literalmente. Cinco pasadas la una. Ok, o la una y cinco. It's five after one. In the other picture we have... It's one fifteen. It's one fifteen. Or it's a quarter after one. A quarter after one. Recordemos que quince minutos es un cuarto de hora. Right? So 15, it's 115 or it's a quarter after one. 15, la una y 15 o la una y cuarto. Okay, that will be in Spanish. It's 130, it's 130. Y también podemos decirlo de otra manera, que no está acá, pero ya se las puedo. The other way is this. También podemos decir, it's half. Past or after one. Media hora, la una y media. Half significa medio o media. Entonces aquí indica la media hora, es la una y media. It's half past one. Or it's half after one. Podemos usar cualquiera de las dos palabras. We can use past. Or we can use after. We have another time here. It's 140 or it's 20 to 2. It's 20 to 2. En este caso decimos los minutos que faltan para la siguiente hora. Son 20 para las 2. Y entonces aquí ya no usamos el after, sino que usamos the preposition to. It's 20. To two. Son 20 para las dos. Or x140. Now in the last one, x145. Son las 145. 145. Or en español decimos falta un cuarto para las dos. O faltan 15 para las dos. So in this case, in English it's the same. It's a quarter to two. It's a quarter to two. Okay, easy, right? Very easy. <laughs> A ver, how can I say son las ocho y media? How can I say 
How do you say son las ocho y media? It's 8.30 or it's half past after eight. It's half past eight. Or it's half after eight. Yes. Nice. Ya veo que están en la onda. <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, in this slide we can see if it's a.m. or p.m. Okay, it's seven o'clock in the morning. So in the morning we we say a.m. Okay, repeat after me, a.m. 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 It's seven a.m. It's 7 a.m. Mm -hmm. It's 12 o'clock or uh -huh. it's 7 o'clock in the morning. It's 7 o'clock in the morning. Oh, y luego al mediodía, ¿cómo se dice al mediodía? It's noon. It's noon, exactly. It's 12 o'clock. It's 12 p.m. p.m. or it's noon. Noon. Okay. Practice. Practice. It's noon. 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 It's noon. <laughs> okay. Then we have it's four o'clock. Four o'clock. The afternoon. 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 Yes. It's 4 p.m. Yeah. A veces les apago el micrófono porque se escucha la interferencia. I'm sorry. Pero cuando quieran participar lo pueden entender. Es que ahí a veces escuchamos la plática que tiene la familia. Ok. It's 7 o'clock in the evening. In the evening. It's 7 p.m. Entonces, la tarde noche, cuando está atardeciendo, es, es evening. Ok, it's evening. Mm -hmm. It's 7 in the evening. Or it's 8 in the evening. It's 7 p.m. Now, we have it's 10 o'clock at night. Eso sí es noche, noche, at night. It's 10 p.m. It's 10 at night. It's 10 at night. It's 12 o'clock at night. It's 12 a.m. It's 12 a.m. Or it's midnight. It's midnight. Medianoche. Medianoche. It's midnight. It's midnight. Now, I'm going to ask you some questions. What time do you go to bed? What time do you go to bed? What time do you go to bed? I go to bed at 10 p.m. I go to bed at 10 p.m. What time do you go to bed? Let's see, um, Briseida, what time do you go to bed? I go to the bed at 10 p.m. Okay, 10 p.m. Elisa? What time do you go to the bed? Um, I go to bed. H. No sé. Ah, vale. Para responder sería I go to bed at. Para sí. decir, esa es otra cosa importante. Miren, cuando decimos la hora, para decir a las o a la, usamos uh -huh. la preposición at. Entonces sería I go to bed at y luego dice la hora, la hora que se va a dormir. I go to bed o a la cama. I go to bed at. Elisa. What time do you go to bed? I go to bed 
8 p.m. p.m. At 8 p.m. But why are you in the class? Eh, a veces. <laughs> <laughs> okay, because the class is at 8 p.m. <laughs> or you are you are having the class on the bed. Antes. <laughs> ah, okay. Before the class, antes, antes de que tuviera clases de inglés, se dormía a las ocho. Mm -hmm. And now? Uh, nine. At 9 p.m. Okay, good. Rosibel, what time do you go to bed, Rosibel? I go to bed at... Quiero ver... 1, 2, 3, 4, yeah. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Uh, y media. <laughs> Up 9. 9. 9. Up 9. 30. Up 9. 30. ¿Cómo dice 30? 30. Up 9. 30. Up 9. 30. Exactly, yeah. No, yo lo quería decir como está aquí. X has. Pero ya sé. X has. Uh -huh. Ah, vaya, entonces sería. I go to bed as half past as nine. Past. Uh -huh. At half past nine. At half. I go to bed at half past nine. Yes, that's correct, Rosibel. Very good. Thank that's you. David Ventura. Present. <laughs> okay, David. What time do you have dinner? I go to dinner. I have dinner. I have dinner. I have dinner. 6 p.m. At 6 p.m. Wow, that's very early. Me too. High five. <laughs> I usually have a dinner at 6 p.m. Yes. Okay. Catherine, Catherine Vanessa, you are very serious today. What time do you have dinner? ¿Cómo se respondía, teacher? I have dinner at I had dinner at 8 p.m. At 8 p.m. Oh, so you are in the class eating. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and the last question. Let's see, Darlene. What time do you wake up? <clears throat> what time do you wake up? Aquí le, wake up, wake up. Ese es el verbo. I wake up at. Um, I. I have. Sería teacher. But I wake up. I, ese es el uh, verbo despertar. Despertarme. Me despierto uh, a la. I wake up. I wake up at. At. I wake up at. Um, 14, 4 a.m. Okay. Uh, can you repeat, please? What time do you wake up? I wake up 4 a.m. Oh, very early. You wake up at 4 a.m. Wow, Miriam Darlene. Why? Why so early? ¿Por qué tan temprano? It is the working. Oh, because you go to work. Yes. You go to work very early. Wow. Oh, my respect to Miriam Darlene. <laughs> okay, very nice, guys. Vaya, vamos. No se preocupen que ahorita vamos arrancando. Ya se van a ser expertos en ahora. Okay, so over here in this picture, you can see a clock. This is going to help you. 
Okay, so, if you notice in this part, todos los que están aquí, vamos a usar la expresión. Ya saben, la forma fácil es solo decir los dos números, vean. Like, in this moment, in this moment it's A26, right? It's A26. A26. Esa es la forma fácil de la hora. Pero les voy a enseñar otra manera de decir. Ok, this, in this case, ok, aquí en punto decimos o'clock. Y luego decimos, si se pasa aquí al, al uno, sería five minutes, right? It's five past. It's ten past. Y aquí vamos a poner la hora. Y aquí le vamos a poner el I. Uh -huh. Entonces vamos a to tomar en cuenta, vamos a poner un ejemplo aquí, las 8 y 5. A o 5 or E. E. 5. Pass. Pass. ¿Qué número iría? 8. Exactly, it's five past eight. Okay, y si está aquí en el dos, diríamos if it's ten past eight. Eight, exactly, it's ten past eight. Okay. Okay, then we can say it's A15 or it's, it's a quarter past, o también se podemos usar after, past eight, y así sucesivamente, and so on. Remember, you can use past or you can use after. Y en esta, you can use to, or you can use, what is, what is the opposite of after? Before, exactly, before. Les leí la, la, los labios. I read your lips. <laughs> okay, so, in the number four, it's 20. 20 past A, it's 25 past A, it's half past Eight. Y ya luego aquí ya no voy a decir eight, sino voy a decir nine. Todos los minutos que me faltan para las nueve, para la siguiente hora, que es nueve. Sería it's twenty-five to nine, it's twenty to nine, it's a quarter to nine, it's ten to nine, it's five to nine. Or it's twenty-five before nine, it's twenty before nine, it's a quarter before nine, it's 10 before 9, it's 5 before 9. Uh -huh. Right? Do you have any questions? Y en los cuando, por ejemplo, sean los un minuto, dos, tres, cuatro, one, two, three, four, decimos el O. X, X, for example, X, A, O, three. X, A, O, three. Hmm? We use the expression O. Okay. You can take you can take a picture of these so you can have it and review. I I forgot my cell phone, guys. I'm gonna give me a moment. I will go and take my cell phone because I forgot it.
Okay, guys, I will send you this, okay? So you can have it over there. How do you feel this? Do you feel difficult or easy? How do you feel it? Are you ready to practice? Yeah. Okay, what time is it right now? It is 8.32. Or? Or it is 38 tonight. Mm. And Sí, es un 38. No, 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 28 sería. Exactly. 20. <laughs> 28, 29. Okay, don't worry. We are going to practice right now. I have here one exercise to practice. <clears throat> okay, what time is it? You are going to help me to complete to match, to match uh, the correct time, okay? Yes? Okay. Okay. Um, so, for example, what time is it? It's a quarter past five. It's a quarter past five. Yes, correct. It's a quarter past five. Okay. What about what time is it? It's two o'clock. It's two o'clock. Mm -hmm. It's the next. It's half past seven. It's half past seven. Yes. Okay. Next. It's 12. It's 12. Uh, 12 or it's 12 o'clock. Okay, next. It's 20 to 1. It's 20. It's uh, 20, 20 or 20 to one. to 1. Yes. Okay, next. It's 20 past 8. That's correct. It's 20 past 8. Okay, the next one. It's 25 past 8. Five. five past two. Mm -hmm. Next. It's five past six. Mm -hmm. oh. No. It's a quarter. No, 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 no. Mm -hmm. It's five, five to eight. eight. It's five to eight. Cinco para las ocho. It's five to eight. Okay, next. It's a quarter to eight. Quarter to eight. The last one, right? Mm -hmm. Next. It's, it's a quarter past eight. It's a quarter past eight. Okay. It's twenty to twelve. It's twenty to twelve. It's ten fifty or. It's it's ten to eleven. It's ten to eleven. It's five twenty five or it's twenty five past five. Yes. And the last one is five past six. It's five past six or it's six o five. Very good. Nice, nice guys.
They're very intelligent. Good, in the next one, ah, this is more difficult because you have to see the watch. Mm -hmm. The clock, sorry, you have to see the clock. So take a look at the clock and tell me. It's four o'clock, the first one. It's four o'clock, yes. It's four o'clock. Okay, the other one. It's half past two. It's half past, past two. It's half past two. Okay, the next one. Six, six, six o'clock. Six, six, six o'clock, right? It has to be a six. It's six o'clock. Okay, then. It's half, half past, past one. one. It's half past one. Okay, then we have. It's two o'clock. It's two o'clock. And finally. It's half past one. Uh huh. It's it's half past eleven. Yes, it's half past eleven. Very good. How do you feel with this exercise? How do you feel? Do you think it's easy or difficult? More, more or less. Más o menos. Yes. More or less. <laughs> okay, I'm going to make here some questions, guys, and you are going to practice with your partners, okay? You're going to practice with your partners. What time do you, okay? What time do you? Y lo vamos a hacer, la vamos a escribir de las dos maneras, okay? Okay. The first question will be, what time do you wake up? La respuesta sería, I wake up at, y se pone la hora. The second is, what time do you have lunch? I have la respuesta, I have lunch. At. Todos escribamos ahí. What time do you drink coffee? I drink coffee at. What time do you you go to sleep or go to bed. I go to sleep or go to bed. I go to sleep at, okay? Only four questions, okay? Only four questions. Okay. So, um, in groups, in a small groups, you're going to practice this. You're gonna ask your classmates, what time do you wake up? Repeat after me. What time do you wake up? What time, what do, time you do you wake up? What time do you have lunch? What time do you have lunch? What time do you drink coffee? What, what time, time do you, do you drink coffee? coffee? What time do you go to sleep? What, what time, time do you go to sleep? sleep? Exactly. Y la respuesta sería, I wake up at 5 a.m. I have lunch at half past 12. I drink coffee in the morning at 8 a.m. I go to sleep at 10 p.m. Okay, so make sure to take notes. 
Okay, make sure to take notes. Take notes on your classmates' answer. Now, I'm going to send you to breakout rooms and you have to practice. You're going to practice. ¿Qué van a hacer? Ya se las Practice the questions, ¿ok? Ya se las voy a volver a enviar para que las tengan en el WhatsApp. What time do you have lunch? What time do you drink coffee? What time do you go to sleep? I go to Very good. Hay que unirse a las alitas, ¿ok? A ver, Elisa, no ha podido entrar. Marilyn, Yesenia, Fátima, Adriana. No han podido entrar. Ahí está. Hello. Erika, Jonathan, Stephanie. Okay, I want to hear you. I want to listen to you practicing. Okay, no sé quién va a empezar. A... Okay, Erika, what time do you wake up? I wake up at 6 a.m. What time do you have lunch? I have lunch at 1 p.m. Okay. What time do you drink coffee? I drink coffee and 3 p.m. Hello. I want Hello. to hear you. I want to hear you practicing, guys. Los quiero escuchar practicando. Yo creo que falta que terminen los compañeros. Ah, ok. Ok, I have a question. What time do you drink coffee? Uh, I drink coffee at half past five. 
<laughs> okay. In the afternoon or in the morning? Uh, afternoon. Five afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. You drink coffee um, alone or do you drink coffee with your mother, your sister? Um, with my mother. <laughs> with your mother. Okay. <laughs> That's great. Okay. David, are you ready? Yes. Nice. <laughs> okay, you can practice with Michelle. Okay. Hello, Michelle. Hello, David. <laughs> what time do you like weather? Uh, can you repeat, David? <laughs> Please. What time do you like? What up? What time do you wake up? Do you wake up? <laughs> I wake up at 4 a.m. What time do you like for lunch? What time do you have lunch? Mm -hmm. I have a lunch at noon. At noon. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What time do you? Sí, otra. Sí. What time do you have lunch? I have lunch at one o'clock p.m. What time do you drink? Do you drink coffee? One o'clock p.m. Okay. okay. What time do you drink coffee? I don't know. I don't know. Continue, please. <laughs> Teníamos una consulta, teacher. Okay, tell me. El caso de la conversación, ella... Bueno, cuando ella me pregunta a mí, yo le digo, eh, por ejemplo, I have lunch at eh, two o'clock p.m. Para anotar la respuesta de la otra sería, she have the lunch. Sería, she has, she has she lunch has. at two p.m. Ah, she has lunch. Sí. Esa es la. Has. Eso, eso lo vamos a ver, el, lo van a ver en el siguiente módulo. Ah, pero como para contestar de ella. Ah, está bien, mire, ya fue adelantado. She had lunch. She had. Siempre decimos at, al final. Ajá. O lunch termina. No. She has lunch at 2 p.m. Ah, ok. Very good, very good. Hop. Hi, making at four o'clock. What time do you have lunch? I have lunch at eleven a.m. What time do you drink coffee? Hi guys, did you finish? Hi. Yes. Hi. That's great. Okay. So we're going to come back. Wow, what do you say there? <laughs> we're doing sick. I hope I hope you don't get sick. What you want to see? Are you sick? No. <laughs> right. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's come back.
Okay, is everybody here now? I I hope so. <laughs> is everybody here? Okay, guys. Um, I was checking you your practice, and it was very good. Uh, when you practice in groups, it's uh, it's very nice because. You are speaking English with your partner. You are practicing pronunciation and listening. And I just have this observation, okay? Be careful. Never use AM or PM with the expression of clock or with the words morning, afternoon, evening, or nine, okay? For example, never say this. I'm gonna tell you one example. You don't say, I wake up at 5 a.m. at 5 o'clock a.m. We don't say that, okay? We, it, it, that's not correct. This is incorrect. The correct form is, I wake up at 5 o'clock at five o'clock or I wake up at 5 a.m. Okay, just that. But don't, don't mix, no revolvamos. <laughs> we don't mix, we, don't, we never use both. We never use both. So this is incorrect. But this is correct and this is correct. Okay? So don't forget. We never use both. No usamos ambos at the same time, al mismo tiempo. We only use one. Okay? So wake up at 5 o'clock a.m. is incorrect. Okay? You say, I wake up at five o'clock or I wake up at 5 a.m., okay? Yes, is it clear? Very good, nice, nice. Okay, wow, time goes so fast. What time is it, guys? What time is it? It's three. To nine. Excellent. It's three to nine. It's three before nine, or it's eight. It's eight. Fifty-seven. Fifty-seven. Yes. Thank you, Bree. That's correct. Well, in the next, in the next slide. Sorry. In the next slide, you will see. This conversation, it's I'm really hungry. I'm gonna read the conversation. And this conversation, we are going to make, um, we're gonna make it in, in page tomorrow, but I'm gonna read for you so you can have an idea, okay? It says, hi mom, what are you doing, Steve? I'm cooking. Why are you cooking now? It's two o'clock in the morning. Well, I'm really hungry. What are you making? Pizza. Mmm, pizza. Now I'm getting hungry. Let's eat. Okay, so tomorrow you are going to work in this conversation, okay? You are going to uh, practice in pairs. So, but you have to change the information. You're going to change the activity. We're going to change the time, okay? So um, maybe everybody can make their own conversation. Todos pueden hacer a su propia conversación. Y mañana, pues ya solo la practican con el compañero que les toque. Okay? Is it clear? Yes, okay. I already sent the conversation in the WhatsApp group. 
so that you can uh, work on that. Very nice. Now I'm going to write here in the chat some hours or some time, and you have to tell me what time is this. Okay? Me lo van a decir de las dos maneras, the easy way and the other way. Okay? In the two ways, de las dos maneras, the two ways. What time is it? <laughs> in the chat, in the chat. A ver, eh, Karen Tatiana, what time is it? The time in the chat. El que está en el chat no puede abrir el micrófono. <laughs> ok. Que le ayude Linda. Ah, ok, Karen, Karen, go ahead, Karen. Mm. It's three o'clock. It's three o'clock. Very good, very good. Ok. Next. Linda. Linda, what time is it, Linda, in the chat? Que... Que... La forma fácil, ¿qué número es ese y qué número son los siguientes? Eh, 40. It's 4. 40 clock. 40 clock. 4. A clock. No, las 4 y 6. Mm, no vi entonces, pensé que era las 4. <risa> vale, mírala otra vez ahí. Forty. No, four. Forty is forty. Four. Four. Ajá. O. El cero lo decimos o. O six. Yes. It's four o six. six. Or. It's uh, six. O. Oh. No, también podemos decir x los pas pas uh, four four exactly six pas four very good Maria Vilma what time is it Fifty past of uh, seven. Mm. Oh, yeah. oh, fue mucho. <laughs> but the, la forma fácil ten. y la otra. Ajá, it's ten. Eh, after. No. Ten. Aquí lo tengo. Aquí lo tengo. Ten. Two seven. Before seven. Yes, para las siete. Ah, eight. Hey. It's ten to eight. It's ten to eight. Okay, ten. when I mean, okay. Marlon. Marlon. What time is it, Marlon? Ten to Marlon Adonai, what time it's is it? 11, it's 11.15. Exactly, it's 11.15. Or, it's 15 past 11. 15 past 11 or a quarter past 11. Okay, okay guys. Uh, be, um, uh, be attentive. I'm going to send some exercises in the in the WhatsApp group so you can practice. You can practice telling the time. Okay, it's important because imagine 
you are in another country or you are working here in a call center and they tell you the time in English, you need to know. You need to know this very well. Okay, it was a pleasure to see you. I hope you have sweet dreams. See you tomorrow, guys. Have a good night. Sweet dreams. Good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.